Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be teaching you guys a way that you can make your own profile pic to use on either YouTube, Discord, or any other social media platform. So first what you're going to do is you are going to go into Animations MoCap. And keep in mind that this is doing everything on mobile, so that way if you don't have access to a computer, um, this will be able to show you how you could do it by only using your phone or your iPad. Um, so once you get into the game, you're going to come over here, you're going to walk into the screens room. You are going to go to the green screen. Make sure that you close out all of the different windows on there. Zoom in. And then take a screenshot. Okay, so next you're going to open up an app called Background Eraser, um, and this is what it's going to look like once you open it. You select the screenshot that you just took, and then you're going to need to crop out your avatar. Okay, now that, that you have your avatar cropped, you can then go ahead and you can click on target area and then it's going to delete all of the green screen from that area that you selected. Um, you do need to make sure that you get the little areas as well because it's not going to delete everything in one swap. Oops, I just made a mistake. Let me fix that. There we go. Okay. Let me just check for a little bit more. Okay, that one's not working, so I'm going to do it a different way to remove those. Okay, so now we're just going to look at it, see that we have everything right. Um, I think it took some of my hair away, so I need to fix that. I'll undo, and then I'll just try to re-delete this stuff over here. Yeah, that one's not working either, so I'm going to show you the other way that you can erase it. And then you're just going to straighten it out. Okay, so now click Done, and then you're going to hit Adjust, and then Smooth. And then you're just going to smooth it out. What this does is it removes a lot of the green lines from the outline of your avatar. But you don't want to smooth it out too much, because if you smooth it out too much, it'll delete part of your avatar as well. So once you see the way that you'd like it to be, go ahead and do that. It's going to pop up with an ad that you need to watch um, before you can actually save it. Um, and then you can just go ahead and save it. Then the next thing that I do is I go ahead and I open that picture back up. Um, and I like to zoom in to make sure that I get all of the green out. So you can see here that there are little pieces of green there that I will go in and I will manually erase out. Um, I do make the width of the eraser very, very tiny. Um, so that way I don't delete the areas that I don't want to have deleted. Now there is the option for restore and when you do restore it turns all the areas that you had erased red so that way you could restore them back to the original color in case you do accidentally erase something that you did not want to erase. So that's what I'm doing now. <laughs> Okay, so it looks like we got all of the different green areas deleted. Um, now I'm just going to straighten up my avatar again. And once you have it straight, you can go ahead and hit Done. Now save it to your device. It is going to pop up with another ad. But once you do this, um, then you're done with this application. And we're going to move on to PixArt. So I like to use PixArt to make the actual design of the profile picture. Um, first, what you want to do is you want to choose a background, which this is the one that I chose, and you want to select the ratio to be a square. When you select the square, you do need to zoom in to make sure that you cover in all the different white areas, and then you can add your avatar to it. Okay, there you go. So now all we're going to do is we're going to add a nice border to it 
What this does is it helps it stand out from the background. I don't like it to be too thick, um, just a nice thin line is fine with me. The coloring that I use is based on the coloring of the avatar. But there you go, there you have it. There is your new profile picture that you can now use for Discord, Facebook, YouTube, or any other social media platform. Anyways guys, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial and I hope that you learned something new. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please make sure that you do so and join my Roblox group today. Bye!